It was all a lie. <laughs> Look, it was all a lie. Hey, hey what's, what's up, up kings and queens? queens? It's Theo. And it's Say. Today, man, we're about to talk about the Prince family's uh, coronavirus video, man. Yeah, they're scared that they had. That scare tactic they did. Oh, my, oh God. my God. For I bet real. you the kitties were about to go crazy. I know the Prince family don't have the coronavirus. Oh, my gosh. I hope DJ, baby DJ is okay. Like, for real, like... Obviously, we're glad that he's fine and he's okay and it wasn't coronavirus. Spoiler alert, spoiler alert it wasn't. He don't have the coronavirus yeah, and everything like that. Yeah, stomach bug. But, <laughs> these motherfuckers... Um, they milked that shit for like 37 minutes? Yeah, they just made a whole video trying to pretend that they had, like, he had the coronavirus and everything. But yet, like, they were taking him out in public. And yes. We, touch carts and shit. Obviously, if you have the coronavirus... You need to quarantine your ass. Stay your ass home. Um, call a doctor. Try to see if y'all can get tested if you can. If they can have testing in your area. Right. Just, just, I don't know, uh, build yourself, I mean, uh, build your, try to build your immune system up. If you know, if you have the symptoms for coronavirus, first of all, you need to go get tested. Once you find out that you have it or not, then they're going to quarantine you so that way you can get better and that way you won't infect other people. Yeah. That's what you need to do. And remember, man, <laughs> it's airborne. It's airborne. So I don't think it should be wise if you think you have a family member that has coronavirus and you're allowing them to walk to, the, I mean, go into different stores and everything. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and just, I don't know, man. Damn. Okay, first of all, let's start off with this. So when they said that, I think Damien pointed the camera in DJ's face and, or Bianca's face and was like, what did he say was wrong? And then Bianca was like, he said that uh, his he had a headache and that his stomach was hurting and he didn't feel well. Okay, so mm -hmm. these are signs. And if a kid is saying they don't feel well, you should take it seriously, especially if they she checked their, his um, temperature. I think he had a fever too. They said that they tried to call the doctor's office and they couldn't get an appointment until like later on throughout the day. That day, yeah. Right. So then from that, then Damien proceeds to go into their pantry and show that they have like six packs of water and a whole bunch of different shit. And he's like, oh, we're not prepared and it's better to be safe than sorry, which is true. It's better mm -hmm. to be safe than sorry. And he's like, we got to go to the store. I'm sorry. All I seen was, and I know they just showing the pantry and stuff. I shouldn't be just jumping to conclusions. But I'm like, do y'all cook bes anything besides noodles? noodles? Oh yeah, they seem like oh the fuck they cook is noodles. I mean, shit. I mean, I mean, what? I mean, I don't want to be too nosy or look at your free in your freezer and stuff. But judging from the past, knowing how Bianca cook, I wonder did y'all get y'all skills up or what? But that's a whole nother video, right? Now, now I'm I'm glad to see that y'all had all y'all progressive, y'all progresso, progressive, whatever. I don't know y'all soups. Y'all had a whole bunch of cans of soups and shit like that. Yeah. But anyway, so they went, um, kept putting the uh, camera in DJ's face, right. even though they're claiming that DJ is sick. Like I, my whole thing is like, all right, you feel like your uh, kid is sick. Why do you feel like you always have to stick a camera in his face, like, mm -hmm. and and just. I don't know. I mean, okay, for me personally, if I don't feel well, I don't want a camera in my face. And I just want to lay down and probably sleep or at least, you know, try and get some type of nutrients some of those lines until I can actually go to the doctor. Mm -hmm. Mind you, kids, they don't really know how to communicate that well with us mm -hmm. at a younger age. So he's, you could just tell he's sick. So instead of them having him like rest and everything, they're like, okay, well, let's go to the store. We got to get more stuff in case of the coronavirus. And then, you know, here go Damien. Oh, they don't got no toilet paper. The toilet paper out. Oh, wow. the water is out. The whole time DJ just sitting in the cart <laughs> looking, looking sick. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. Nah, we skipped a part. What? We forgot, like, okay, like like we said earlier, DJ may have the coronavirus. Why would you go and take him to the new house to show a new house oh, tour? Right. Him touching around, showing all the different places. Like he just his showed different, DJ's room. Yeah, DJ room and all that different stuff. Why would you bring a kid in there if you think he has this serious illness? Because we don't they didn't think he had the coronavirus. Because we don't have a um we don't have a cure for this strain. Mm -hmm. So why would you do that? Like and have a chance to infect other people that's gonna be viewing the house, even though you know this it may be yours anyway. We don't know if you're really gonna pay for it, but it may be yours anyways. So, like, we're going to jump back. They went, after they spread a little disease over there to the uh, new house, they, they rode to Target. Mm -hmm. 
Damien parked on the uh, curb. Right. So they went to Target. Um, he just, I don't know, man. I don't know. He just, uh, a DJ, I don't know. Go, go, go. Uh, I was going to say, like, the Do whole time they were just walking around with DJ, he looked like he wasn't feeling well. Damien even went back and got another buggy. They had two buggies full of shit. Mm -hmm. And then even, now there was one thing that I saw, and I kind of was like, okay, y'all are being excessive. Remember when it was, um, I think they were on the baby aisle, and it was a formula? Mm -hmm. It was probably, like, six or eight cans of formula. Damien was like, get all of that. And I'm thinking, like, okay, I'm pretty sure, I, I hope. That y'all already have maybe like at least one or two cans of formula in the in the house. And I realize that babies go through formula a lot. But y'all also need to think of other people too. Yeah. Instead of y'all getting like all of the fucking formula. Like you know there's a reason why it was only a couple left. Because other people were trying to get this stuff for their kids too. Yeah. And I, I will say this. I do like the fact that they did go and get stuff for their kids. Because one thing I have been noticing when we went out. Is okay the water and the toilet paper were gone. But the shit for y'all kids was mm -hmm. full. Fruits, veggies, all that stuff. Which is a problem for me. But I, I, so I was like, okay, I'm glad y'all getting stuff, but damn. It, but it's just like, okay, the whole time they had DJ out. They said he wasn't feeling well. They get out of Target. They come home. And Damien puts the camera in his face again. He's laying on the couch covered with a blanket. Then he's laying on the floor. And then Damien's like, dang, he doesn't look like he's feeling better. Maybe we should just go to the doctor. And D Bianca's like, what? Then, like, emergency room or the doctor, doctor? Mm. And he's like, the doctor, doctor. Mm. Like, duh, bitch, the doctor, doctor. You know the place where we supposed to get an appointment. Yeah. So then he was like, <laughs> he was like, uh, and we, you know, we got like an hour and we're going to we're gonna go out and get some more stuff mm -hmm. before we go to the doctor appointment. Then they get in the car, and I think they were supposed to be going to get food. Yeah. DJ throws up, and then he's like, and Bianca isn't feeling well either. Yeah. And it's like, oh, no. So then they, they get to the doctor's office. Um, the doctor gives the kid medicine. He come home. Homeboy just riding, riding, riding around. <laughs> riding the bicycle, happy as shit. Woo! <laughs> you know? Like nothing happened. That medicine worked pretty damn quick, bro. Just and around all of the other kids. Mm -hmm. While and I'm thinking like, now y'all said he had a stomach bug. That's mm -hmm. contagious. Mm -hmm. Why y'all got him around y'all other kids? And Noah's a baby, and I don't know how old mm -hmm. Kyrie, Kyrie is, yeah. but you know they can be prone to catch it too. Then later on, they show um, Link DJ was like laying down again. And then they showed them, like, getting the food from the carry. And Damien was like, oh, we got to spray the handle. She's trying to peep in the house. And I'm thinking, like, first of all, why the fuck are you not helping he bring in the groceries? He ain't shit you but just, filming. You just holding the camera. Like, yeah. God, damn. Just, it, 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 we got to spray it. She touched it. Da, 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 da. I'm thinking, like, help your wife. Please. <laughs> please. Because all you've been doing this whole time, from, the, from Target to the doctor's office, even at home, uh, what you're doing with the uh, Walmart pickup or whatever when they deliver the stuff, all they doing is fi all he doing is filming. And I can I, I ask, like, excuse me, if they having this woman deliver, you know, <laughs> deliver groceries and shit, why in the fuck didn't they just have the woman deliver groceries in the first place? Y'all yeah, had they, to. Why didn't go to Target? Y'all had to go to Target. Y'all had to bring Kyrie to. I'm oh, not Kyrie. Y'all had to bring DJ to Target. Like, and, and grab shit. Like, yeah. seriously. Like, we can tell it's all for a video. We know you're getting paid for it. We know you, well, I don't know. Cause you, probably, you, uh, you put coronavirus in it. You know, every time yeah, you put so coronavirus, it's going to be demonetized and yeah. stuff like that. But we, I, it just blows my mind. Like, what in the fuck? Uh, did y'all go to the store? If y'all going to do this damn, uh, what's it called? Point pickup or whatever I don't know what it is. was that they did. But delivery. my thing is, if your if your child is sick, sick, then stay home. Don't be taking your child out in the public. Like one of y'all could have went and got mm -hmm. groceries, and the other person could have stayed with him. Mm -hmm. Instead, y'all bringing him in and out of stores, and that's not gonna help the situation. Cause all I was wondering is like, are y'all dumb or just careless? Like seriously, it's just careless. I feel like we're being careless. <sighs> it's I don't know, man. I don't, I don't know. know. It was just a quick little review, little overview about the uh, whole situation. My old, like we said earlier, if you feel like your kid has coronavirus or anybody in your family has coronavirus, quarantine them. Don't have them around the other kids. Don't take them out to the stores and stuff to spread this uh, disease that does not have a have oh, this strain of disease that doesn't have a, a cure. Don't be spreading that around the store even more. I mean. 
I remember when I remember the last week when we was at Publix or whatever. Uh -huh. The women just say we're finna go grab a pizza. The women come right in front. <coughs> It walked off. up right in front of the thing she was in the grass. I, 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 <laughs> I know. I was like, <laughs> like I was livid. Like, come on. And okay, I'm gonna say this too. I know sometimes that parents they have to take their kids in the store whenever they're sick. Like, if, you know, if you don't Obviously. have, yeah, if you don't have somebody to watch your kid, but with them. Y'all, what of y'all could have stayed home with the child? Another yeah. person went out and got some. Y'all didn't have to film that bad. Like, you really could have kept this to yourself. Just like how y'all <laughs> didn't have uh, the two youngest, Kyrie and uh, Nova, with y'all when y'all went to Target or whatever. Obviously, they stayed with somebody. So, one person could have stayed home and watched DJ. Right. Like, it's not that serious to make a fucking video. I'm, I mean, my, my family's health is way more important to me mm -hmm. than making a video. For subscribers right like you said earlier dj was wrapped up in a blanket sleep mm -hmm. he was asleep yeah he was if damien came up to the camera came up with the camera in this boy this in the boy face this close oh he sleep dj you oh he <laughs> sleep. he rested and like and then and then when it was <laughs> finna go dj was curled up like On this like this like her he like dj man you okay man then they you said you okay up three times you know, niggas now, be exaggerating, thing, bruh. <laughs> uh, I heard Bianca when she was talking to the doctor, the nurse, and she, we, I could tell that she was attentive because she was telling her everything that had happened. Yeah, because Damien didn't Damien know. Damien was just fucking mute over there. Like, just oh, filming, bruh. Like, yeah, I hope you're okay. Hope, maybe she all put prayer hands in the comment section. <laughs> well, y'all better be Shut happy up. for some damn fake pranks and shit because if it wasn't for YouTube, but well, I don't know what kind of person Damien would be. Like, he's, he's dropping not, from girl to girl. Because he really seemed irresponsible. <laughs> he seemed like he don't care about anybody but himself and YouTube. I mean, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. It's just what you putting out to me. I know to your little subscribers and stuff, y'all the Prince family, y'all, y'all, y'all care. Y'all do this and that. I don't know. I don't know, man. It's just... Well, I would say we'll end it on this note. You tell I don't got shit yeah. else to talk about. I would say y'all like, comment, down below, subscribe. Let us know what you think about this video. Whether you agree with what we had to say or whether you disagree. If you do disagree, tell us why. Um, if you agree, tell us the reason why as well. We'll probably be doing more videos like this. And y'all are more than welcome to send us stuff in our um, Instagrams as well as in the comment section down below too. We finna have these kids at our next. I Fuck y'all. Just have, <laughs> at least have your own profile so I can cut y'all a little badass. Yeah, make sure no your picture up. I don't want to see nobody coming negatively if y'all picture ain't there. Don't write shit. Otherwise, I'm going to be like, I'm just going to disregard this because you, you didn't even put your picture up. Come back to me when you put your picture up. Peace.